A local restaurant finding success in a busy Kansas City restaurant scene. In fact, the restaurant is so popular, the owner plans to open a second location. Let us eat. Only on 41 Action News reporter Andres Gutierrez explains what makes this eatery stand out from the pack. What I think uh, I really missed was a, a place where you could go that was a casual atmosphere, um, but really perhaps sophisticated food uh, for breakfast or lunch. What began as a hobby for Robert Joseph ended up bringing a taste of Australia to the heart of downtown Kansas City. So some of the classic items we have, the lamington, uh, which is a vanilla sponge, a layer of raspberry jam in the middle, dipped in chocolate sauce and rolled in coconut. Banksia at 9th and Baltimore opened in late 2017. The cafe whose meat pies have been featured on diners, drive-ins and dives is quite popular. We get so busy down here, there's lines out the door and um, I hate to say it, but I don't think people love waiting uh, maybe 30, 45 minutes for, uh, for a table for their breakfast. They're now in the middle of opening a second location at the Board of Trade building in the South Plaza neighborhood. Look, I think this is a great, uh, a great building. Joseph has also purchased the storefront next door. The former Lark Burger space will house a new Chinese restaurant restaurant called Duck and Roll. Really, to, to keep up with today's times, I, I, the time of being mediocre in the restaurant world in Kansas City is over. Even though one of Joseph's neighbors in the new space, Stockhill, filed for bankruptcy and another, a former brunch spot, Ellie's, closed after a year, he doesn't believe it's a bad omen. Um, I think really what probably happened in these locations previously was more related to the businesses themselves, not the location. Experts say new restaurants have to stand out to succeed. And then there's so many concepts that are very creative that are coming to Kansas City that I think the future looks bright as long as you're operating right. Joseph agrees. Uh, we aim to have something that's a little bit different to what people have had before, and I think uh, people will really enjoy it. That was Andres Gutierrez reporting Duck and Roll set to open in mid-January. Oh, it looks good. Followed by Banksia in mid-March.